and it even works for Washington DC Metro tickets. Here's something interesting I came across. It's a business card printer, although printer is in quotation marks because it's really just a business card dispenser made to look like a printer. And it has an LCD clock built into it. And the packaging doesn't have any brand name on it or anything. Just lists some of the features. Press the button, business cards come out. LCD clock, calendar, month and date. Uses two AA batteries and one button cell for the LCD. And there's a photo of what it looks like. Doesn't have any branding on the printer itself on the box, but if we open it up and take it out, we can see it's branded as IBM and it was a promotional item for their IBM Printer Selection Center. I looked that up, it's still in business today, although they use a different phone number now. They sell very large industrial and commercial grade printers and they even still make dot matrix printers. So I guess they would go around trying to sell printers and then when they would want to give their business card to a client, they would hit the button and it would spit out a business card that they would hand off. And I think this is from around 1997. Certainly fits the styling and the beige color. And I think this one is missing the output tray because you can kind of see it on the box here where the business card would come out of the back. It would have a tray to hold it. But this one didn't come with that. But you can see the holes where the tray would attach and that's the slot where the business cards come out. And it runs on two AA batteries. And also the internal button cell battery for the clock has gone dead. I could open it up and try to replace that, but you can see what the clock would look like. It's just a standard, very basic LCD clock. To demonstrate the business card printer in quote marks, or inverted commas if you're British, which I've never understood calling it that because you can see only the opening quote marks are actually inverted commas. The closing quote marks are just raised commas. But anyway, we can put in some Duraleak batteries. And now we're ready to open it up. It's rather stiff. But there's where you load your business cards. And it has an adjustment for how thick or thin they are. Looks like it's in the middle position right now. And you can see the rubber rollers that are powered once you push the button to spit out a business card out of the slot in the back. Now I don't have many business cards and none for myself but I'll use what I have including some things that are not really business cards but are the same kind of size. So that just closes like that and now we can push the button and start dispensing business cards. So, it's kind of neat. I mean, if your job is to sell IBM printers and you want to give somebody your business card, what better way to do it than have what looks like an IBM printer print out a business card for them? Yeah, it sometimes doesn't come out straight because these cards are different thicknesses and some of them are glossy, some are a matte finish. So if you have all the same kind of business cards, like your own personal business cards, it would work a lot better because you would be able to adjust that thickness setting to match your cards. And it even works for Washington DC Metro tickets. I don't know if they still use this design today, but this is what I have from probably 10 years ago. Still has some value left. In case they ever want to go back and use it again. Yeah, that one's kind of thick, so it's having trouble with that. So that's just a neat little piece of IBM paraphernalia from their printer selection center. And it's just the right size to match this FM radio designed to look like a computer, which I did a video about a while back. So I think even today this would be pretty neat to have on your desk. An FM radio made to look like a late 90s desktop PC with a matching IBM printer. To hit the right note on your personal computer, you go.
got to have the right personal printer. That's why IBM offers an ensemble of personal printers. For text, for color, for graphs, for pictures, for speed, for charts, for letter quality, for whatever you compose. IBM Personal Printers, for the finishing touch.